scale back tonight for Georgia. They've had a lot of different injuries. And they're back because of all the injuries and suspensions at the position. This is the handoff to the aforementioned Smith. Murray threw an interception the last time he was on the field. Let's see how they respond here. Completes it to his good buddy going back to and healthy for next week's game against LSU. On first and ten, Murray off the play fake completes this one to Tavares King. Murray keeps it and weaves his way down. Holding. Offense number seven. Huge penalty. All the problems they have they've had in their backfield with suspensions and injuries to be sitting here with nine in a row is a pretty big deal. Murray fires wide open to Charles over the middle, still on his feet and into Georgia Tech territory at the 47-yard line, a 31-yard gain by the muscular but speedy tight end. And this is where a tight end really helps you is in the seam. Watch as Charles runs right down the middle of the defense, the seam meaning between where the two safeties are set. You hear about that cover two all the time. That means two deep safeties. Well. Murray has this one batted down at the good about the rhythm his quarterback's in. Completed five of his last six. They bring a little pressure and a nice call with the screen. Charles. King split wide to the bottom of the screen. They go with the bootleg action and wide open. It's Orson Charles with the first down and then some. Into the end zone. Wide open. Touch. This is not quite as needed on defense. Murray finds Orson Charles still on his feet. It's loose. Plays knocking on the door. And once again, Murray with a good play fake. Riding the running back. And Charles trying to make something happen. Very lucky. He got a very lucky. Gets some valuable separation. And off his number. Gets some valuable separation. And off his number three. Third and two here. Handed off to the fullback. A rare touch for Ogletree. And making the most out of the opportunity. Or look at it. Charles comes over in motion. And because it's so short, he can't even get a block on the fullback. Or excuse me, on the linebacker. A loss today, I think, knocks them out of contention for that game. Brandon Smith with the top of the Bulldogs. First down and ten at Georgia Tech territory. Carlton Thomas straight ahead. Was this was yesterday 17 to Arkansas? So here's um, Malcolm again in the Honey Bear. Uh, <laughs> first and ten. Once again, straight ahead. But even if Virginia Tech were to win out, second and seven. This is Malcolm again. 